In our Growth Point teaching today, we will be taking a look at Ephesians chapter 3, verses 20 and 21. They read as follows. Now to him who is able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine, according to his power that is at work within us, to him be glory in the church and in Christ Jesus throughout all generations forever and ever. Amen. God is able to do immeasurably more than we can ask or imagine. Think about that for a moment. Allow that thought to sink into your heart and into your mind. What is it that you are asking God to do? How is it that you are trusting God to work in your life? God will do for us not only more not only more than we can ask or desire in prayer, but also more than our imagination can, per can perceive. We must realize and recognize though that this promise is conditioned and, and dependent upon the degree of the Holy Spirit's presence, power, and grace operating in our lives. So as you and I are trusting God, as you and I are believing God, as, as you and I are depending on the Holy Spirit to work in us and through us, what is it that we are trusting God to do? What is it that we are imagining God to do in us, through us, for us? May we realize that His power is at work within us and that as God answers our prayers, it is for His honor, it is for His glory, so that our hearts and other people's hearts will be directed toward the Lord. So as you continue to trust Him, as you continue to believe Him, trust Him for the impossible, believe for the impossible, because with God, all things are possible. Let's pray. God, we thank you for the truth that we find in these verses. Help us to hold on to you and to trust you, knowing that your plans, your purposes, your ways are best. We ask, God, that you would continue to work in us and through us so that you would receive all the praise, all the glory, and all the honor. I pray this prayer of blessing over you. May the Lord bless you and protect you. May the Lord smile on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord show you his favor and give you peace. Because of you, Jesus, and the hope of heaven, we believe and we know the best is yet to come. Amen.